I'm Silian. Welcome to my art channel. In this video, I'll be showing you how to draw an easy, step-by-step -step picture of a toucan. Enjoy! We'll put down our branch and our foot of our toucan just to give us an idea where he's sitting and then we'll put the leg above that keeping everything in proportion and draw the chest go up to the beak and the head slope down towards the tail and the feathers underneath. It will block in the areas where different colors are different colors are shown or different types of feathers. Parts of the wings. Some have shorter feathers and longer feathers. So those will make a difference later in the, in the detail. Well, let's start with a green color around the eye. Using short strokes in a circular direction. Clockwise around the eye with a light green. And add some light blue turquoise. Keep going around the eye in a circular clockwise manner, adding on more green. And filling in the spaces with yellow, or yellow green. That's to give the appearance of short fine feathers on the face and chest area. Just keep layering with light green and then yellow green. Going further down, switch to heavier on the yellow and lighter on the green. And add in some white areas, white, off-white, gray, <clears throat> add some shading with a darker gray under the beak, and under the chest. And continue filling in with light green and yellow green. And continuing with the bill. The upper portion has a mostly green color, light green, very bright. The top part is left somewhat whitish as the sun is shining there. The front end of the beak is a beautiful magenta, dark reddish purple. both the top and the bottom parts of the bill and the very bottom the very end of the bill has some orange color to show the translucency of the bill as it overlaps on, on the lower portion and then there's an orange line extending from the, the reddish purple all the way up close to the 
eye and widening on the lower half of the bill there's a general light blue color with a patch of green, light green if you have different shades of colored pencils mixing, adding different colors mixing them together that all gives a nice effect And let's stop with our start with our bird brain. Using a black, draw short lines coming from the top of the head, going downwards and spreading out as we go. Try to make them slope down in the direction that they grew from. Add to that a dark reddish a darker purplish red as the highlight and some dark red to accentuate that continue with longer feathers coming downwards and these are very dark blue almost black but with a blue shine to them. And here come the longer feathers of the wings. First a pretty even row. Oval shaped ones. We'll first color in with black and then the same blue color. row on the back and for the rest of the wing longer feathers all of these are pretty much the same color different shades depending on where the light is if you're enjoying this video please click the thumbs up and subscribe and click the notif notification bell for more videos For the darker areas on underneath the wing and towards the leg, I like to first put down blue color and cover that up with the black to give the blue more of a background and to really show that it's darker down there. Underneath the tail feathers there's like a tuft of white feathers and next to that another tuft of bright red feathers so I'll layer that in with the different shades of red some darker, some brighter and some black to give it some texture and depth and the portion directly underneath the tail will color that a little darker here we come to the long tail feathers that will detail with long strokes from the middle coming down in diagonals and there are a few of those together so we'll layer them in one underneath the other with black and color, color them in with dark blue The stem area in the middle is is light, so we'll leave that white. And here come the other tail feathers. And the darkest portion on the very bottom. After the green, light green throat, 
There's a very small area between there bordering with the black and blue. That is a reddish tuft of feathers. Small red border. And we'll just accentuate the colors on the beak, bill, the magenta, the orange. And add some of these. They look like al alligator teeth, but they aren't. They're just small lines, both on top and of the bottom of the bill. Not exactly aligned. <coughs> And pretty much random. And here comes the bright blue foot hanging on tightly to the branch. We'll layer that with a few different shades of blue. Just show how it circles around the branch as it hangs on. And we'll go over the, the more smoother parts of the feathers with a blending stump to give it a more smooth, homogenous look, leaving the areas that have a, a more uh, texture alone. Let's just put in the branch so he actually looks like he's sitting on one. You can add leaves if you'd like, twigs, and there's our toucan. <laughs>